was always about just going on on Saturday and having fun and, and it was something I enjoyed doing, but I never really thought it would happen. The form year was finishing and just plodding around in Canterbury and didn't have much going on the way of rugby and Hawks Bay offered me sort of a development contract so I thought why not take it and come up here and have a crack and see where it leads. You know, probably one of the best decisions I've, I've ever made. The New Zealand under 20s, I was actually um, talking about it last night with Charles Pietau. It was pretty daunting turning up to that first camp, you know there was lots of people's names that were getting thrown around for some reason even in super rugby teams at the time, like Sam Kane and Gareth Anscombe. Also, I was just coming out of club rugby in Hawke's Bay and got down there and just played rugby the way I enjoyed it and lucky enough to make the team. Tom Commentary sat me down in his office one day in Hawke's Bay here in McLean Park and said, oh, you know, I'm going to be the coach of the Chiefs, the forwards coach, would you like to come up there? And it was a pretty casual chat to be fair and I didn't really know what he was implying like and a couple of days later, I was just back in the office, he goes, oh, I've got that contract for you if you still want to come to the Chiefs, and obviously I was uh, pretty excited then, you know. Uh, the All Blacks coaches had come around and just after my 21st birthday, a couple of days after that, they were standing in the tunnel at North Harbour Stadium and they just pulled me aside and said, congratulations, you know, you made the All Blacks. And, uh, it was a pretty surreal feeling, it took sort of a day or so to sink in, you know, especially uh, at that age and I wasn't expecting it at all team name and come around and I was starting. I was pretty nervous from then on. It was like two or three days before we ran out and just the whole experience, you know, the haka, singing the national anthem. I was at Eden Park, I think it was a sellout. My mum and dad was in the crowd as well and my brothers were watching at home and it's just something you never forget, you know, the, the feeling of for that first time pulling on the jersey and uh, it was like a dream come true. Last week against the Old Wallabies and we had our backs up against the wall from week one and we had a lot of pressure put on us and I think it's probably the most dominant uh, tight five performance I've played in just some games. That it just seems to happen like that. Always in the right spot, you're always getting the ball in your hand and um, everything's going as it should. I guess it's games like that, you know, that you walk off the field proud of what you've done out there and it's what it's always been about for me. Um, it's having fun because if you're having fun doing something then you're enjoying it.